flamingo tongues were considered very delicious food to be cooked and delivered to a Roman table. Not only was it said to be very tasty, but the luxury and delicacy of this dish was something which made the upper-class Romans love it. And if rich Romans really wanted to impress their friends, they would serve the whole flamingo at their banquets. It should be noted that sacrificing a bird in ancient Rome was believed to impress not only mere mortals, but the gods as well. They were also considered a representation of the wealth of the owner. In Roman times, having a roast flamingo on the table was a status symbol and a means of flaunting one's riches. Truly wealthy gourmets ate only the choicest parts, like the brains and tongue. Emperor Elagabalus was even said to offer the costly bird in sacrifice to the gods when a regular old chicken would have done just fine. Apicus, the most gluttonous gorger of all spendthrifts, established the view that the flamingo's tongue has a specially fine flavor. Speaking of Apicus, the Book of